So very briefly, I want to touch on YouTube cards. This is a way you could promote things like another channel, a link to your website, an affiliate product, a promotion, a playlist, another video, all from within your YouTube live stream. So what you want to do is click on the cards tab and then click on add card. So if you want to add a video or playlist, I could pick one of them from here, an upload or a playlist. Easy, right? Add card, channel, I could promote another channel. So you could live stream and promote your buddy's channel. He could live stream and promote your channel. These are the type of cross networking a lot of big YouTubers are doing right now to massive success. Remember how big the audience is on YouTube as a whole? There's no way you have a real stronghold on your audience unless you start really cross promoting and getting every possible subscriber that you can. Poll. If you wanna ask your users a question, this is a great way to do it. So like, let's say you're a product creator like myself. What do you wanna see as my next product? What do you guys really want help with right now? An easy way to gain some feedback from your customers or potential customers. Link. Link to an approved website, so powerful. So you can link back to your own website, uh, to an affiliate product, or what I'd recommend you doing is linking back to a lead magnet. So li link back to something that is really valuable, something that they'll trade their email address for. So even if you lose them after the live stream, you'll still have a way to contact them, to market to them in the future. That's pretty much it when it comes to Twitter cards, sorry, YouTube cards, uh, Twitter also has cards. YouTube gives you this chance to put your link out there to promote your different playlists use it so don't just let this go to waste and on your regular videos cards should be used as well so I have cards on every single one of my videos on YouTube as you I'm sure you've noticed and while there's a bit of a difference between a live stream card and a YouTube channel card the only difference really is that on the YouTube cards you could put in a, a channel subscribe button same thing otherwise so uh, on the next lesson, we're going to talk about some advanced settings within your YouTube Live dashboard, and then we're going to move right on to OBS and get you live streaming right away. Let's go.